Hi, I'm in Wellington Park in Somerset, out for a lovely stroll around, admiring the beautiful flowers here. It's one of my favourite places to come to see floral displays. But today, there's somewhere else in Wellington I can go and admire floral displays, and that is the Wellington Flower Show. So I'm going to nip on over there, I'll take you with me, and we'll go and have a look to see what's going on over there. It's in South Street at part of Wellington School, and I'll show you where it is when we get there. Hello squirrel. The Wellington Flower Show takes place twice a year. There's a spring edition and also the summer edition. This is the first time that I've actually been to one. So I'm really looking forward to it. I think it should be a really good community event. There's going to be people entering so many classes of competition from all age groups, from little under fours, I believe, right up until, well, as old as you can get. So really looking forward to seeing what there is. It's not just going to be about flowers either. There's loads of different categories you can enter into. There's photography, baking, there's uh, vegetable growing, fruit growing, as well as flowers and floral displays. So much. As I walk over to Wellington School, I'm walking through Wellington and I'm just struck by how blooming lovely it's looking. There's just flowers everywhere in planters, in hanging baskets. It's just really beautiful. So I've just arrived here at the Alan Rogers Centre at Wellington School. It's right next door to the sports complex. And I'm about to go in and have a look. Let's go on inside. Now I'm no gardener, but I do appreciate the time and the energy, the commitment and probably the talent as well that goes into creating and growing these beautiful things that we're about to look at. We're going to look at some plants, some flowers, some veg, some knobbly veg, um, a whole array of things. There's going to be children's art and craft in here as well and so much more. Just have a look around with me and enjoy. We'll have a look at the trophies as well and then in a minute we'll move next door and look at the baking room. Wow, what a talented bunch, excuse the pun. I'm really inspired to want to be more green fingered and to be able to grow things like that, oh my goodness. And the craft work by the children as well, absolutely beautiful. So let's go next door now and have a look at the baking. I think I called this a bakery room, but it's more of a cookery room and it's jam packed, jam packed, sorry, <laughs> with homemade jams and pickles and also breads and cakes so much yummy stuff in here and amazing children's tea party entries as well sorry about the jam pack pen that came out by accident
gonna go downstairs and have some refreshments in a minute but first of all let's go and have a look at the craft room there's lots of different crafts in here i believe there's going to be um sewing and photography that sort of thing i love how it's so local here like there's a category for photos taken in wellington park so this category was to make things out of an old pair of denim jeans Oh my goodness, looking at all these cakes and things upstairs made me really hungry. So I'm so grateful that there's refreshments downstairs and it's absolutely buzzing down here. It's feeling to be really popular. I just got myself a lovely cup of tea and the last piece of banana and carrot cake. I'm really looking forward to tucking into that. Got myself some raffle tickets upstairs as well. Just outside, you can pick up your plants from a very local trader, Ford Nursery in Oak. Oh, that was just such a lovely local event. I hope if you live in Wellington, or even if you don't live in Wellington, that you really enjoyed that look around as much as I did. It's just so nice to take part in local events. You can hear the church bells ringing in the distance as well. There must be a wedding on this afternoon. It's a nice Saturday afternoon in August. So yeah, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. Definitely recommend getting down to your local flower show as well. And if you're in Wellington, come to this one next time. Please, there's one in the spring and in the summer as well. So see you in another video very soon. Bye for now.